Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this episode, I'm going to demonstrate to you how you can resolve a fail to resolve item ID false in your panel view HMI. This panel view is from Alan Bradley or Rockwell. So let's get started. So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to launch uh, Factory Talk Studio view here. Um, and this is my project, right? So uh, I'm going to run it as a test. Uh, this is going to be synonymous to your panel view running itself. So I don't have a panel view to show you here, although I have a VNC, but I'm going to click this here and uh, run the test application. It's going to take a bit of uh, time. So I'm just going to fast forward here. Okay, the HMI is running. It's running on a station mode, I guess, uh, factory talk station. This is not panel view itself. So I've got a widget here for P sequence. So when I click on, I'm just going to clear the alarm banner at the bottom here just uh, to get a clean slate. And I'm going to go back to my station view here. So when I click on this widget, uh, the plant packs widget for P sequence, uh, see how the error pops up on top here. Uh, after you go range here and this guy here, I'm going to try to config the state. You can see that uh, it says fail to resolve ID false, right? So this is one of the error that uh, we're going to remediate. So another thing uh, to note is that on the panel view, you can see uh, some of the error messages here being truncated, uh, pound2.cf, right? But on your on your factory talk view, uh, the diagnostic bottom section, you can actually see more stuff. So that's one thing to take note of. But anyway, so I'll show you how we can resolve this. Any errors after the false errors are all actually stemming up from this error here. So spoke to Tech Connect, uh, they don't really have an idea why they uh, why this happens, but uh, uh, I do know the remediation for that. So I'm gonna close everything in here. Okay, so the way to remediate, I'm just gonna go back to my factory talk here. Uh, let's close our session here by pressing X to close the session. Okay, the factory talk view ME station is shutting down right now. So, okay, so let's remediate that. So in order to remediate that, uh, you, what you have to do is uh, you got to expand uh, your HMI tags, double click to open the HMI tags. What you're going to have to do is to create a new tag called false. So it's going to expand this guy here. So click new and the name of the tag will be false, right? And then it'll be of type digital. Uh, let's not put description here or you want to put description you can put description which appears at, on this table here afterwards it's going to be of a data source type of memory and then uh, the initial value will keep it at zero and we tentative will leave it as unchecked once that's done click accept and you'll see that the new tag will be created right here false digital right and it looks like that so once that's done you can close your hmi tag screen here and unfortunately you're gonna have to uh, do a rebuild again one more time so i'm gonna clear this guy here and then go test application to rebuild into the factory talk view me uh, station format so i'm gonna fast forward on this one here too okay once this uh, station is started again one more time i'm gonna click on this i'm just gonna clean this up here clear all and go back to my station view again. Now this time around, if I click on my widget for the P sequence, you can see I'm going to have to go there first right uh, here, here. And then if I click on this config state now, you can see that there's no more errors popping up, right? So yeah, so th that's the way to remediate that uh, ID false. Not too sure why uh, you have to create it. I don't think Tech Connect has quite an answer for me quite yet, but anyway, to get rid of that, all you had to do was to uh, create on the base, uh, the root itself, create a tag called false of the uh, data type digital, and it's gonna be, have to be a source of memory there. Anyway, if, if this tutorial helps, please thumbs up and like. Other than that, have a good day, bye.